this fight, this fight with announcement, with announcement, and progress, made progress made for the successful, for the successful vaccine. vaccine. Soon, soon, it's ex the expectation, the expectation is the FDA, is the FDA will, run will run process of process of reviews, reviews, and, reviews approvals. and approvals. And the process, the process must, must also be grounded in science and fully transparent, so the American people can have every confidence that any approved vaccine is safe and effective. At the same time, it's clear that this vaccine, even if approved, will not be widely available for many months yet to come. The challenge before us right now is still immense and growing. And although we are not in office yet, I'm just laying out what we expect to do and hope can be done, some of it, between now and the time we are sworn in. But so uh, the purpose of this is to let you know what we're going to do once sworn in. And so uh, there's a need for bold action to fight this pandemic to do and hope can will not be widely available for many months yet to come. The challenge before us right now is still immense and growing. And although we are not in office yet, I'm just laying out what we expect to do and hope can be done, some of it between now and the time we are sworn in. But so uh, the purpose of this is to let you know what we're going to do once sworn in. And so uh, there's a need for bold action to fight this pandemic. We're still facing a very dark winter. There are now nearly 10 million COVID cases in the United States. And last week, we topped 100 cases in the United States. And last week, we topped 100 cases in the United States. And last week, we topped 120,000 new cases on multiple successive days.